this stream makes me so happy. <laughs> oh man. Oxlane, this stream makes me want to YOLO my shards too. Hold strong, Oxlane. Hold strong. <laughs> or get involved. Up to you, mate. Up to you. Have fun with it. Go and look. Go and look. No one saw anything. Content creator perks. Because I'm not part of the team. I don't get that. So I have to use my own <laughs> shards, right? No one saw that, did they? All right. So I'm going to pull. How many do I need to do here? Nine? Nine? Are you going Ten. for Akimtum? No. No, I don't have enough voids on the account, and you just not. I I just feel like when there's a two times void and I pull a whole bunch of voids, I'll pick up that champion anyway. Probably, yeah, yeah, I agree. Um, let's just say so. I'm going to do ten. Will we get gold on the main? Get your predictions in. I saw someone basically said if you pull for Akinton, you get four thousand eight hundred points, so they've increased it because it's a guaranteed void. I'm like, it's... yeah, but they chose to do that, right? I I don't buy that as a even reasonable excuse no I, but I that's think... what they will probably say the reason why if you ask them they would say oh well there's a guaranteed and look at the times 10 champions are available i'm like yeah but that's not a, no, a justification that's, that's not an acceptable thing and it, the other thing is if you look at the kind of the path there right it's awful the first it's row. awful it's really like... it's really bad but some people might value the immortal soul stone but up until this point it's really useless, mm. isn't it? It is. It's useless up until three and a half thousand. And, There's uh, nothing like... in there that people need. Right, I'm going to do 10 shards here. Honestly, I guess I don't have a um, Autumnborn. So that would be quite cool really to get. Really good. Really good champion. So oh, I really flexible. would love a Teodor, Zaf. Teodor's where it's at. I, I, every time I do a shard pull, it's basically I get blue in the face now. It's basically... Um, I want a Kaimar, I want a Teodor, and I want a Calvalax, and all I keep getting is duplicate Shemnaths and duplicate, which is great. Yeah. It's just not... You know what? How good would this have been on my free-to-play? Amazing. Rumble. Like, I actually said, out of all the four epics we had in the last fusion, he's the one that, if you wanted to keep an epic, he'd be the one, because his, his damage is really good on his A2 because of the, the extra multiplier he gets, but you also get an ally protector and a leech. So he's one yeah. of those champions where you can build him to be your ally protector team. And then later on, if you don't need him in an ally protection team, he can be a damage dealer or he can be a, a different type of champion. So he's not it's, a complete It's not waste. just ally protector though. He's also bringing weaken and leech. He's huge. Yeah, oh, it's man, passive as well. So it's huge. Good. They're doing so that good. That is huge. Yeah. So, <sighs> okay. But you know, you've got a Cornelia, so. I did. Play. <laughs> still not sure how i feel about it <laughs> i would say sleep on it but that's a meme somewhere there yeah she'll send me to sleep oh man yeah i'm not sure how i feel about that one oh, i think i know how i feel about that one because i'm not like this cormac's a useless champion isn't it yeah he's one of the worst in that faction i think isn't he? he's got a couple of debuffs but i, I don't even make, targets, i don't understand but... what the purpose of him is just uh who shards are these these are my main account shards big johnny at the moment so we're just going to log into Saf's free to play oh. in a second. Hungra. Dear Lord. Look at the little things on his belt. It's gross. <laughs> I need to, um, yeah, I need to get watching some YST solo videos, don't I? Yeah. Trouble, trouble with Cornelia. Like, I know she can solo a load of stuff, but she does it all so slow. That's what puts me off about her. I think the Doom Tower stages where you were talking about will be where you'll find the most value out of her because if you hit a stage you get a little bit difficult with, her sleeps will come in clutch. And I think that's... Yeah. She's yeah. that kind of champion where she probably won't put her in any team. Ooh! Oh, we've got an Elva! Come on! Yes, we'll take that. Join in the Deadwood Club. You've right. got Elva, haven't you? Did you you forgot on the, the guaranteed, right? I was one of the... I was part of the problem. I pulled on with the 20. Yeah. 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 So I decided Huge. not to, but that is... A really good pull, actually. Because she is the that. only champion in the game that places an increased speed buff, a block debuffs, and fully cleanses on a three-turn cooldown. It's the only champion in the game. Nice. Um, and actually, as well. you can do some really clever stuff. Like, if you get a Hall's Ring one day, or if you have Turvold, you can do some really funky stuff with a passive and her A1, where you can literally, like, buff them to infinity. Um, Hall's Ring obviously increases his own critical right. damage by 30% uh, when he's under a Veil. But under like a single target, he can't veil himself. So every time she takes a turn, as long as everyone's on 100% HP, 
she will always put the veil on the leader. If you put yeah. Holzering or Turvald in the leader, like Scratch did a video with a plus oh, four okay. Turvald. That's interesting. And he uh, he got like 10 buffs on Turvald permanently, pretty much. It was gross. Yeah, damn. She's actually really She's good. Okay, that's, that's actually... I, I was thinking we're going full epics there, so we'll take that. Now bring that luck to my free-to-play account, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> there we go. We'll take that. Okay, right. Moving on then. So will we get Legendary on mine? The answer was yes, we will. Just one more set to do then. Let's do Safs. We'll take that. That is nice. 